Hi everybody, I'm Tom Elliott with John Deere, and today we'll show you how to adjust and operate a Frontier VT17 series vertical tillage tool. We'll be using a VT1712 today, but all four models in the VT17 series adjust and operate the same way. We'll be using a John Deere 6120E utility tractor. It delivers 120 engine horsepower and includes a standard 12 Ford 12 reverse power reverser transmission. We've also added 1,400 pounds of weight to the front of our tractor and 240 pounds to each rear wheel. That's so we have enough weight on the tractor to help prevent tire slippage. Step one is to adjust the gang angle. First, lift the unit onto the transport wheels. Then secure it with the transport lockout bracket. Then use the gang adjustment wrench that's stored on the unit's drawbar to adjust the gang angle from 0 to 12 degrees in 3 degree increments. Once the gang angle is set, replace the gang adjustment bar over the slide plate and use the hairpin clips to secure it. Once you're in the field, set the unit's working depth with a simple pin and clip system. Working depth can vary from one to three inches. Next, make sure the vertical tillage tool is leveled from front to back by using a simple crank mechanism. Turn the crank clockwise to lower the rear of the tool. Turn it counterclockwise to raise the rear of the tool. You should wait to adjust levelness until after the unit's working depth has been set in the field. Once you've set the gang angles, depth control, and level the unit front to rear, you're ready to begin operation. Remember, it's very important to have the transport wheels in contact with the ground and have some pressure on them during operation. Otherwise, the depth setting you've chosen won't matter. The unit will simply till as deeply as it can. The VT17 series vertical tillage tools are designed for operating speeds between six and 10 miles per hour. Ideally, you should vertical till at a slight angle to the direction of the crop rows to do the best job of sizing the crop residue. After you've made a couple passes, check to see if the down pressure on the rear mounted rolling basket should be adjusted. If the residue is not flowing easily through the rolling basket, the down pressure needs to be reduced. If the field surface and sized residue isn't level and smooth behind the unit, the pressure needs to be increased. Down pressure is adjusted with a jam nut and a hex nut on each of the two spring rod assemblies. Loosen the jam nut, which allows you to increase or decrease the spring tension by adjusting the hex nut. Once adjusted to the down pressure you want, re-tighten the jam nut to lock the spring in place. Finally, the VT17 series vertical tillage tools are designed to operate in essentially a straight line. So always remember to raise the unit onto the transport wheels before making any turns. Otherwise, you could damage the disc, the gain bearings, and the hitch, all of which are costly to repair. Frontier has over 600 implements that are available only from your John Deere dealer. The place to go for advice and equipment. So remember, for implements that help turn your tractor into the workhorse it was built to be, think Frontier and your John Deere dealer.